in 2017. Bernard Essau's pilchard landings have been good since 2012, but drastically declined in 2016, as only 34% of the total allowable catch was caught. The minister says pilchard stock has remained constant over the past 38 years, only showing a reduction last year. He was responding to questions from DTA parliamentarian Nico Smith in the National Assembly. As I says, the pilchard stock collapsed from 1,4 million biomass levels in 1968 to close to zero in 1975 and has remained constant in recent years. Last year's drastic decrease affected the industry. In 2016, there were 955 Namibians employed compared to 1,701 Namibians in 2015. This decrease reflected the re reduced landings in 2016, which necessitated the use of only one cannery instead of the usual two canneries and reduction in the number of fishing vessels. F furthermore, the industry also imported fish or pelchets from Morocco in 2016 last year to keep this important Namibian jobs afloat. The ministry says it is prepared to take any measures necessary, including a moratorium on pilchard fishing. Such a moratorium would be based on sound scientific evidence which the ministry is busy collecting while also working together with neighboring countries who share the same fish stocks. This situation calls for joint management measures between our three countries on this very fisheries. Yeah. I am happy to report to this August House that the government has concluded a fisheries MOU between Angola and Namibia and is now finalizing a similar one with South Africa, partly to address the management issues relating to shared stocks. The ministry is also in the process of developing a pilchard management plan while also increasing the canning of horse mackerel in factories that were canning pilchard only in an effort to sustain jobs.